Paul Feyerabend, the maverick philosopher of science. On a busy day in Vienna, precisely on the 13th of January, 1924, the world bore witness to the arrival of Paul Feyerabend, a man who would go on to challenge and transform our comprehension of science. Upon delving into his life story, one would quickly discover that his trajectory was as unpredictable as that of a comet and that he was destined to blaze his own trail, defying the established norms of his time. According to Feyerabend, science is essentially an anarchic enterprise. This means that there is no set method or structure that can be universally applied to scientific inquiry. In a society that values systematic approaches, Feyerabend's viewpoint is a critical one, challenging the notion that science must always adhere to a specific formula. By rejecting this idea, Feyerabend opens up the possibility for a more flexible and creative approach to scientific exploration. Who is Paul Feyerabend? Paul Feyerabend was a distinguished philosopher of science who left an indelible mark on the world of academia. His birthplace of Vienna, with its architectural magnificence, had a profound impact on his upbringing. His life was shaped by the tumultuous global events of the mid-20th century, including the horrors of World War II, which he experienced firsthand. Against this backdrop, Feyerabend was exposed to a rapidly evolving European scientific community, which was engaged in a fierce philosophical struggle to define the nature of science itself. These challenging circumstances provided Feyerabend with a crucible within which to forge his groundbreaking ideas, which continue to influence scientific discourse to this day. Famous philosopher and academic Paul Feyerabend received his PhD from the prestigious University of Vienna in 1951. During his time there, he had the unique opportunity to engage with some of the most brilliant minds of his time, including Thomas Kuhn, Karl Popper, and Imre Lakatos. These interactions played a pivotal role in shaping Feyerabend's views on science and fueled his passion for questioning the most fundamental aspects of the discipline. Thanks to these experiences, Feyerabend emerged as a thought leader in the field of philosophy of science, and his contributions continue to shape the way we think about scientific inquiry today. What was Paul Feyerabend's scientific contribution? At the heart of Feyerabend's contributions lay his book Against Method. A bold critique of the scientific method, it sent ripples across the scientific and philosophical communities. He argued that the so-called scientific method was more a myth than a reality. Instead, he posited that science progresses through a mix of anarchic strategies, intuition, and even chance. The only principle that does not inhibit progress is anything goes, he remarked. In his philosophical views, Feyerabend emphasized the importance of not being confined by strict and inflexible approaches to scientific research. Instead, he championed the use of multiple methods and a mindset that is receptive to diverse perspectives when dealing with scientific inquiries. His stance aimed to inspire a more open and flexible approach to scientific pursuits. The theories put forth by Feyerabend were not simply abstract ideas. They were based on a thorough examination of actual scientific revolutions throughout history. One notable example he observed was the case of Galileo, who chose to endorse the heliocentric model despite the lack of concrete evidence available at the time. This decision represented a departure from established scientific methods and was a risky movie that ultimately paid off for Galileo and his supporters. Why was Paul Feyerabend against method? According to Feyerabend, the rejection of rigid methodology was an affirmation of creativity. He held the view that strict adherence to a particular method could impede the advancement of science. His criticism was not aimed at science per se, but at the entrenched and method-focused approach that was commonly touted as the sole means of accessing scientific knowledge. 
He was concerned that a dogged loyalty to a particular methodology could hinder the emergence of groundbreaking concepts. Paul Feyerabend was a firm believer in the idea that there are numerous viable paths to success. This philosophy carried over into his personal life, which was marked by a series of diverse and often unexpected experiences. Born in Vienna, Feyerabend originally aspired to become an opera singer and spent several years performing in theaters throughout the city. However, his life took a dramatic turn when he was drafted into World War II and sent to fight on the front lines. After the war, Feyerabend turned his attention toward academia, where he would make his most significant contributions. Despite the many twists and turns of his life, Feyerabend remained a man of contradictions. He married Grazia Barini Feyerabend late in life, and their relationship brought him great joy and companionship. At the same time, he was fiercely dedicated to mentoring the next generation of thinkers, and his guidance left a profound impact on many of his doctoral students, including Nancy Murphy. Through it all, Firebend remained committed to questioning established norms and pushing the boundaries of accepted knowledge. Upon reflecting on the life of philosopher and academic Paul Feyerabend, one cannot help but consider the valuable lessons that can be learned from his journey. One of the most impactful lessons is the importance of daring to challenge the status quo. Feyerabend firmly believed that just because something is widely accepted, it does not necessarily mean that it is correct. Therefore, he encouraged individuals to challenge, question, and redefine the boundaries of understanding. By doing so, one can broaden their perspective and potentially make groundbreaking discoveries. Another lesson that can be gleaned from Feyerabend's life is the value of embracing diverse experiences. Feyerabend's life was full of a variety of experiences, ranging from his time in war to his love of opera. These diverse experiences shaped his unique perspective on the world and ultimately contributed to his success as an academic and philosopher. It is important to recognize that life's varied paths can often lead to the most profound insights and growth. Lastly, Feyerabend championed the importance of open-mindedness. He believed that keeping an open mind in all aspects of life is crucial to achieving success and making meaningful discoveries. In science, Feyerabend advocated for the importance of considering all perspectives and theories, even those that may seem unconventional or contrary to popular belief. This same mentality can be applied to all aspects of life, as unexpected paths often lead to groundbreaking discoveries. By embracing open-mindedness, one can genuinely broaden their horizons and achieve great success. As we come to the end of our exploration of the life and work of Paul Feyerabend, it's hard not to feel a sense of awe for this remarkable individual who dared to challenge the very foundations of scientific understanding. Feyerabend's legacy is a testament to the power of free thought and the courage to follow one's convictions, even in the face of strong opposition. For those seeking stimulating narratives and insightful analyses, we highly recommend exploring the Chronicles of Legends on YouTube. This exceptional series delves deeply into the lives of individuals who, like Feyerabend, dared to shape the world in their own unique way. Through these stories, we gain a profound understanding of the power of human creativity, determination, and resilience. As you watch these incredible tales unfold, remember that legends are not just born, they are made. Every one of us has the power to make a difference, to leave our mark on the world in our own small way. So why not take inspiration from the stories of these incredible individuals and start writing your own legend today? After all, the world is waiting to hear your story.